Final topic under the moon heading is talking about why we only see one side of the moon. We only see one side of the moon. <coughs> this is because the moon's rate of rotation around its own axis is also equal to its rate of revolution around the Earth. So the moon takes 27 days to go around the Earth once. The moon also takes 27 days to go around its own axis once. <coughs> okay. So for that, a good picture like this is nice. You see, so if the sun is here, what happens is the moon is facing us this way, right? Let's say there is some kind of shape on the moon. So as the moon is going around us, by the time that the moon is a quarter of the way around us, that shape has rotated a quarter of the way around the moon. You see, so the moon is always keeping the same face toward us. So the equivalent of this would be me, let's say this is the Earth. I'm going to go around the Earth in such a way that the Earth only sees my face. You see, so what do I have to do? I have to make sure that I'm always hiding my back. You see, I'm, I'm rotating in such a way that I am always keeping one face. So what, that's what the moon is exactly doing. It's going like this. <coughs> so a typical question that instructors like to put in that uh, section of the quiz is they'll say, the reason we only see one side of the moon is because the moon does not rotate. True or false? And half the students usually put true for that. The other half usually put false. Which one is correct? Who would say true? The reason we only see one side of the moon is because the moon does not rotate. How many say true? Everyone's afraid to vote. <laughs> I'm going to say false. It's false. Good job. I taught you well. If the moon hadn't rotated, what would happen? The picture would look like this and not like that. You see? This one, see how it's rotating? If it doesn't rotate, it looks like this. OK, so. Let me, let me mimic something that doesn't rotate. Imagine the moon didn't rotate. It would look like this. You see? Now, if the Earth, could the Earth see all sides of me? So they would see this. Then they would see this side. And then they would see this side. You see? So the moon does rotate. OK? <coughs> so the moon rotates in such a way that it's always keeping the same face. How about another uh, question that the instructor might like to put? The side of the moon that we don't see is always dark. True or false? The side of the moon that we don't see is always dark. True? Yeah, about half of you said true. False? Okay, about half of you said false. The answer is false. The side, of the, moon, the side of the moon we don't see also undergoes the same phases that the side of the moon we do see. Okay? <coughs> Look here. Oh, this is just showing you another picture of a uh, lunar peak, how the peak rotates, you see, always facing the same, always facing the Earth, always facing the Earth. So this picture is more about how the uh, moon rotates. But I want to show you, um, as a matter of fact, I can go back to this one here. This is the picture that we use to do the phases. This is the side of the moon that we always see. This side, we, we see. This side, we don't see. This side, we see. This side, we don't see. This side we see, this side we don't see. So let's say there's a lunar peak here. We always see that same peak facing us. You know?
I think this is a good way to see this. So you see how we're looking at the same side? Now look at how the moon is lit. When the moon is new moon, the side we see is dark. How about the side we don't see? It's fully lit. So if you actually live there, if you live on the other side, you see the sun on that day. The sun rises and sets, you see? But you don't see the Earth. You just can't see the Earth at all, you see? Now how about here? Now the side we see is mostly dark, a little bit lit. The side we don't see, mostly lit, and the other, uh, this a uh, little bit dark. Now how about this one? The side we see is half dark, half lit. The opposite side, half dark, half lit. And then this one, fully dark, half lit. How about full moon? The side we see, fully lit. The side we don't see, dark, okay? The interesting thing, question to ask is, <coughs> so back to the question of, is the side we don't see uh, dark or lit? So of course, it's, uh, it would be false to say the side we don't see is dark, right? I think there's a movie by the name of The Dark Side of the Moon. So it's a wrong title, right? They're trying to catch people who don't know that. There is no such thing as the dark side of the moon. The other interesting question to ask would be to say, if we ever populate the moon, let's say we go there and we, a uh, we uh, bunch of people start living there, have children, and then they forever live there. Most of their lives, they rarely come to Earth. What would the interesting thing be from the sky? What would they see in the sky? Let's say you have two people, John and another guy, or then we'll call this, uh, we'll make this a female, Mary, John and Mary. What would their lives be like? You know? Mary and John. And then Mary, John. Every day Mary gets up, like this, guy, this day Mary gets up, it's dark. It's actually dark for a while. From here to here, it takes seven days. So for a while, for a while, she's actually in darkness. For one day, two days, three days, see Mary is here. The darkness, darkness. By about the seventh day, the sun is starting to appear. Isn't that weird? Your nighttime there is going to last many, many, many days. You have to go to work, come back. Everything is dark, 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 dark. But the other, other cool thing is you're always seeing the Earth. The Earth is always up in the same part of the sky, never moving. You know, you're living your life, you're going to work, doing everything you're doing, the Earth is always there, never moving, right there. Okay? How about John? John is in the sun, couple days, couple days, one day, two days, three days, four days, John is here in the sun. By the time, about seven days, the sun is starting to set. Okay, how about him? Does he ever see the earth? No. He's on the opposite side. He has no clue the earth exists. Never sees it. The earth never rises, never sets. If he doesn't communicate with Mary at all, he might even forget that the earth ever existed. Isn't that interesting? <laughs> Mary will always see it in the same part of the sky. John will never, ever see it unless he does some traveling. You see? And then the other cool thing is sunlight takes many, many days. Darkness takes many, many days. Okay? Until the opposite starts to happen. You see? Okay, now we get to an interesting topic called eclipses.